Tudo. Welcome, Raffi. How are you doing? Hi, Worm. How's it going? Yo, thank you for the 10 biddies. Gay biddies for you. <laughs> Hi, Teddy. How are you doing? Y'all, I have no idea what I'm going to play today. <laughs> I have absolutely no... Oh, I forgot to turn on my camera. Oh, wait, no. It's too high. You play horseshoe crabs, but with legs. That okay. Where is that? Where is that game? Was that on HIO? That's right. Okay. Horse shoe. There we go. I found it. All right. I'm downloading it right now. <laughs> Looking very dapper. Thank you. I'm wearing this lovely hoodie. Um, also got this great skirt on. Is this cute? And I felt like being cute. Um, yeah. That being said, I it, it actually is a little bit frosty in here. I might change into a different into a shirt rather than a hoodie. <laughs> Ivy, how's it going? All right. Horseshoe crab crab with legs has been installed. That's what we're playing. I don't think that there's a category. Good fit. 10 out of 10, Jen. Thank you. I appreciate it. Uh, let's see. Horse crab rescue. We can't, it's not that one. Okay. Uh, itch. Io. Uh, and small I don't know what category counts for horseshoe crab but with legs I don't imagine this game is going to be super long but we're just categoryless we're going to go back to just chatting that's what we're doing we're, we're just chatting <laughs> Yeah, it's a game jam game, so probably not too long. Yeah, I'd imagine probably not. Okay. Let's do this. <laughs> um, over here, we're going to want to do... I, I don't want to... I, I know it's going to cause issues if we try to do... Oh, game, game capture. Do a display capture. All right, let's go. Horseshoe crab with legs. Oh, run anyways. I trust this random itch.io developer. Horseshoe crab with legs. Levels and about. 10 out of 10. Oh, I got moved my face. Hopefully this game's not, like, wildly inappropriate. It's got three levels. Got a little Minecraft. Bars, get five milk. It's missing. How do I take? I I I see the milk. I want to consume the milk. Allow me to consume the milk, please. Don't horseshoe crabs normally have legs? That's a good question. I don't know. Um, how do I consume the milk? About. Let's click on the about. Aren't lobsters just anchor crabs? 
just a little something for everyone. 10 out of 10 IGA. Milk bad orange juice good. Game by controller overload. Quote, horseshoe crab with legs makes beans on toast. 10 out of 10. I love this. I love this. All right, let's see. Are, oh, okay. Maybe they've got controls. No, they don't have controls listed. All right. <laughs> Well, this is apparently this game's second <laughs> ranked second to last in the game jam. Oh wait, there's a tutorial. Let's do the tutorial. Okay. Also to get up an enemy, press E. Put the milk at the end to proceed. Press Q to pick up objects. Jump on enemies' heads, become them. Oh god, oh ouchie. Ouchie. It's like okay, I'm playing as Oh, I died. Playing as a head crab from Half-Life. Uh, cute. Got milk. All right, that's it. All right, we got this. We got this. <laughs> they really say good luck. Yeah, for real. I <laughs> love. I love this so far. Right. It's a great game. It's great. All right. You just. Oh, we can't pick up the things. We have to be possessing someone to pick up. Things. All right. I have stolen your body. Now grab the milk. Oh God, these controls are. A bit rough. Um, okay. Jump up here. Grab. Nope. Oh boy. Oh boy. We're, we're just a little bit. Just just a just a little bit. Okay, got the milk. Okay, we put it in the area. I think. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> oh no, I want... I wanted to grab the milk. All right, I have to grab the milk. Throw it in the zone. All right, so I've only got a certain amount of time that I can be on people's heads. Need to get wine program not drink it's working so that I can play this game. Hell yeah. Alright. Get on your head. Perfect. Perfect. And oop. Then the two milk over here. Oh, and this milk too. I don't think I actually kept it in the zone. Gotta keep an eye on that food bar, like looks like those are lives. Yeah, that's what it seems like. Throw it. Just gotta wait for it to reach in. And then jump. <laughs> now run, 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 run. Just a just a silly little horseshoe crab, you know. I like that the my mouse is on screen. Okay, let's, oh, sorry, let's take it. Let's take it. Sorry. Let's take it. <laughs> but, oh, I I did it. You get to the end with the milk. Okay. Milk. Let's go. I don't know where the end is. Oh goodness, there's a lot of there's a lot of lads here. Oh that was easy. Okay, level three. Get to seven items in the goal. I gotta adjust my mouse a little. Okay. So pick this up. Put it down. Oh god, I'm getting attacked. Uh why are you hostile towards me? I just was possessing your body. You will drop you. Oh, no. Okay, I think that works actually. Then possess your body again. Pick up the milk. Drop it. I think it just needs to pass through the zone. I like I like the I 
I do like the low poly character that we've got. They're they're very cute. Oh no, I didn't mean to make you hostile. Please don't hurt me. Please no hurty. Oh shit. Oh shit. Please. I move the flower. I think if I just jump on their heads and then they go hostile. So you're not oh no 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 oh okay. Uh, jump on their heads, but don't possess them. They get angry about it. They're like, what the heck? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay. This, this dude turned not hostile. Oh, gosh. Wi-Fi suddenly very bad. Oh, no. I did it. I beat Horseshoe Crab with legs. Are you guys proud of me? 10 out of 10. My rating so far, 10 out of 10. Absolutely banger of a game. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Maybe I should just go on itch.io and just look for small games to play. I'm going to play some music. All right. Let's see. Summer Sale 2022. Oh, wait. I've got a whole bunch of games from itch.io that were in this bundle a while ago. Let's see. Crowd, I am like la so laggy. Oh my god, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, you're laggy. Fingers crossed, it'll get better. Okay, let's see. This song's just a jam, an absolute banger. All right, you know what we're gonna do? We've got a wheel of names with tons of games on it. And so, a whopping 87 seconds of lag. Oh god, that's awful, I'm sorry. <laughs> We're gonna spin the wheel. We're gonna spin it three times, and then you guys- or two times. Yeah, three times. And then you guys can do a pull. Outer Wilds. That's a game I've been wanting to play for a while. Is today the day we do that? We gotta actually set stuff up. I mean, that's why all of these are on here, because they're all games that I've been wanting to play. Close. And then spin again. I'm gonna go reboot stream VRB. Alright, talk to you then. Okay, almost Donut County, but Dreamscaper. I don't even remember where Dreamscaper is or what it is. But at that. We'll we'll do four. We'll do four. And if no one votes, then I'll pick. Forza Horizon 5. Or final option. Little what you know it's. Okay. I'm gonna do a poll for three minutes. Oh. We've got three minutes. Go ahead and vote between those four games. If you don't have a preference, then don't worry about it. I was making a poll. Oh, I already got you. I already made it. I'm I'm five steps ahead of you. <laughs> Is 
I don't know any of those games. Fair enough. Fair enough. Got a couple of different votes. Do I, do I have Little Witch in the Woods? I actually don't know if I have that one. I might have added it to the list, but then not bought it yet. Hold up, hold up, hold up. We're going to switch to this real quick. I got to check. Oh, wait, I think it's on Xbox Game Pass. Let's see. Is it on? It's not on Xbox Game Pass. Hello, game library. Will you please load? Would appreciate it. I don't have Little Witch in the Woods. Let's see how much is it. Uh, okay, I'll get it real quick. <laughs> Because it's it looks like it's leaning that direction, but you know if it swap the swings towards one of the other two games, then you have twenty eight thousand channel points now. Cool, that's so many channel points. It's ridiculous. This song is my banger. Whoa. That scared the shit out of me. Oof. You guys fell. You guys okay? Oh my Christ. <laughs> okay. Wait, that's all good. All right, little witch in the woods. It looks like it's the winner. Okay, I'm gonna pause one second. We fell. How could you let it do this? I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. I gotta. I'm gonna change my shirt. Be right back. No, it's not our sometimes. Stop it. I'm still here. I just turned off the camera because didn't want you guys to see me shirtless. No, stop it. Wait, that was the wrong one. Okay, I've got a, got a different shirt on now. No, stop burning down the chat. Stop it. <laughs> okay. We also got to download the game real quick. Got to actually transfer money to the right account. <laughs> it's like, hold up, this is not right. Okay, there we go. Let's install that real quick. It's a gigabyte, so we've got a little bit of time. I was actually uh, OG to look, uh, OG to comment on how good you looked in the color of that sweater. Also, this is a great shirt. Thank you. Yeah, it was just a little bit too toasty for the, how how hot my room is right now. I am lurking and playing Fall Guys before bed. I om I was thinking about playing Fall Guys, but I want to play it with some friends. I don't want to play it alone. So, that's why we're not playing Fall Guys. 
But for those who, of you who don't know, it just barely came out for free to play for everyone. So that's fun. Okay. Oh, you were going to say going, not OG. Gotcha. You know what? While, while we're waiting for this to download, let's start a new prediction. <laughs> Heads or tails? This is a chance to get a lot of money. A lot of channel points. You can, like, you know... You can raise the amount of channel points that you have by quite a bit right here. So, here you go. Make a prediction. Heads or tails? Which one's it gonna be? Is anyone predicting? I can't see. No one's predicting. No one wants to bet their channel points on the 50-50. <laughs> Oh, oh, we've got one, we got some person predicting a thousand. All right, all right. Is there a way I can raise? Okay. Okay. Let's see. And it's heads. Congratulations to the winner. <sighs> Nicely done. Oh, heck yeah. Yee, you just got 1,020 points. All right, let's try it. Let's do that again. Google, why would you rig the coin flip against me? It's okay. It's okay. We'll start another prediction. We're going we're gonna to do it again. <laughs> 500 points. Big sweat. Hell yeah. Heads or tails. Oh, you already did? Did you do it? No, 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 that's just the results. Okay. We're gonna have a bit longer of a submission period. Two minutes. <laughs> Can I predict? No, I cannot predict. That would just me causing inflation into my own stream. Hi, Ninetale, how's it going? We're flipping coins. Oh, it looks like the game's ready. We're flipping coins to see... Uh, to redistribute the wealth or just you know you get a gamble didn't get the notification that's okay i'm sorry you didn't get the notification did i post in the discord I post in the discord right also if you're new here you should go join the discord it's great <laughs> maybe we should just start every stream with me doing a coin flip <laughs> Oh, I think I need to skip this. I don't think that song is. I'm gonna figure out a way to make me lose some of my channel points, and it's working. <laughs> Gamble, do it. Only 100 channel points? Come on, you could do more than that. You got this. More! <laughs> this is what it means to go even farther beyond. <laughs> yeah, how are you doing, Ninetale? I forgot to say that. How are you doing? Ooh, 500 versus 110. Let's see who the winner is gonna be. All right, let's flip again. Tails it is. <laughs> Congratulations to the Tails crew. Nicely done, nicely done. <laughs> all right, all right, let's... Let's play this game, <laughs> rather than gambling all stream. Let's play a game. Excuse me. This title is software for preview purposes. Some platform feature- oh! I didn't read all that. Is it okay for me to stream this game? 
Hold up, hold up. I need to make sure it's actually okay for me to play this game. Like, on stream. <laughs> uh... Because if it's not okay, just stream- okay. Some game features may not work. Title current doesn't- okay. Okay, it seems like it's fine, because I know some developers don't like it when you stream their game before it's ready. I've seen people play it on Twitch before. Okay, fair, fair. Alright. Let's go. <laughs> Alright, so this is Little Witch in the Woods. It seems like a it seems like a cute, cute little game, you know? So perfect stretch. Oh, pixel perfect of course. Um that's good. Everything seems good. Maybe maybe volume. Okay. Let's go. <laughs> Robin, last night was fruit loops for dinner. Yeah? Well, tonight it's chips and coke. Oh no! <laughs> Get some actual food! Worm! <laughs> Wonder where the carrot was. No, I will. You're still thinking about that? It's found everything except the carrot. It's a good that we never found that guilt. There was something off about that legendary carrot soup I just realized we never checked the men's restroom. Yes, there's just some lines we don't cross. We searched the whole school, save for that place, but we never found the carrot. That means the carrot was in the men's restroom. <laughs> carrot in the men's restroom. What an odd sense of humor. I should write Jenny a letter asking her to look through the men's restroom. Can't you ask Will instead? It's the men's restroom after all. Nope. That coward finds it, he'll take it to the teacher bawling like before. Keep in mind that if it wasn't for Will, you'd be in jail right now. Or six feet under. Ugh, I'm so bored. Flashback. Flashbacks are supposed to be boring. See why no one else wants to ride this god-awful train? It's boring enough to drive anyone insane. New prediction just dropped. What was it? I didn't see. When I gravity roll my d20, will it save 20? Yeah, no, that's not gonna happen. Rig it, it'll commit crime. I'll commit crime. <laughs> hey, a ticket for a train costs 500 times. And it stopped the witch's house in Highway for all loads read to. Me too. You're a second place at school for witches. Whatever, I don't care about any of that. How am I in second place anyways? I even sneaked into the forbidden room twice. Three times. I even looked through the forbidden books in the hidden library at school. Basement. Still remember that horned rabbit was as big as a house. No wonder we started crying. So how did I manage second place? I simply didn't want to lose. Get out and sit quietly. This is a train only for those who want to succeed. The witch's house might be dark and damp, but it's only three years of your life. Fine, fine, enough with the lecture. As a matter of fact, I'm disturbed with the thought of taking off my shoes when I get off the train. Shoes? For what? Wonder what kind of trouble you'll get into when we arrive. I won't. I won't fool around the moment I get there. I didn't know you had self-awareness. Don't you know about the terrible city of rules that is high life? First thing to do is take your shoes off as soon as you get off the train. It's my first time here, except for one. I heard that Jenny's older sister was wearing strappy boots when she first arrived at high life. So she almost couldn't get off because she had to unstrap them completely. See? Mom bought me new shoes as well. Didn't Arya just mean to encourage you? No, Dad did say always... Oh, no. Dad also did say that comfortable boots would be better. That's strange. It's true! I'll ask the other- I'll also ask the other people if you don't believe me. Lace-up boots. It's a pain to wear lace-up boots if you're boarding the train to high life. Tr the truth remains for me. The food was really delicious, though. You face- Your face was bright only when you were eating after getting on the train. The omelette was overflowing with cheese and crab meat as soon as it was cut. 
a pink salmon steak seasoned with fresh lemon scented kiwi sauce. Let's see. Should I do it again? No, okay, for your pink. Alright. <laughs> Even the slightest, slightly frozen strawberries and pe peach sorbet with whipped cream. Without this meal, I would have just jumped off the train sooner. It's definitely different from the food you buy at the store in School for Witches. I need that to collect the Great Witch series cards. I got scolded because I ca was caught keeping the card and throwing away the bread. Never do that again in high I'll definitely try the new because cupcakes there. That's if I get to Highline before I get bored to death. What's up, bartender? Hello, Mr. Bartender. Hey, you want a drink? No, I don't drink alcohol. Do you have any tea? Of course. Then I'll have a cup of that. The tea has alcohol, though. Is that okay? But then that's just alcohol. Alcohol with tea. Potato, potato. Then can I ask you a question instead of a drink? Anytime. Keyword conversations. You can initiate conversations using keywords at your disposal. Okay, interesting. Some water. Uh, personal stories, special, or... I want to ask about the least of these. Can I take a look at your shoes? My shoes? What for? When I hurt, hurt, you have to take off your shoes. You take your shoes off before you step foot into High Line Station. You work at the train, so you know what I'm talking about, right? Oh, that story. Absolutely. Plenty of confused passengers who are all dressed up for High Line. If you're wearing shoes of that sort, I'd advise you to untie them in advance. O oh, ye who reacheth high lion, look for first upon thy shoes, or so that's how the saying goes. See, Virgil, I was right. The preppy boots mom gave me as a present tell me just as much. Those are some nice boots. My mom bought them for me when I when she found out I was graduating magna cum laude. Sure is amazing. You're graduating magna cum laude so despite your antics. You gotta keep up with the attitude of yours? <laughs> Hearing the two of you speak, I have a feeling being boredom or being boredom won't be an issue. Nope, it's so boring. Aren't you bored, Mr. Bartender? I've gotten used to it. But it's certainly gotten less boring thanks to you and your hat. You've been listening? Other guests would have heard about your arson at the school for witches by now. I can set it on fire. Really? Uh, sure, there was a fire, but that was because I shook a potion five times and made it explode. Potions must be shaken three times only. Even a non-lit witch like me knows that. Remember that, everyone. Potions are only shaken three times. We need to remember this. You go to make a potion only three times. No more, no less. Exactly. How can you not try shaking it four times, having heard that? But you said you shook it five times. Nothing happened on the fourth time, so I shook it once more. An inquisitive mind. You've already got the makings of a fine witch. Thanks for the praise. I don't think he was praising you. I should be on my way, then. All right, have a fun trip. You can't act like a country bumpkin once you're in the city, you got it? You're not going to ask for just one person, are you? But one is never enough, you know? Even the greatest detectives never reach a conclusion based on a single piece of evidence. Hmm, you have a point. Notes. Oh, so we can press N to look at notes. It's pain to wear a hot lace up boots if you're boarding a train to highlight. Gotta ask someone else about it. Our character looks a little bit derpy, I like it. I love that walk. It's a fantastic walk. Okay. Oh, we should talk to him about more than just the boots, though. Welcome. What's up? Um. Sha. You only sell alcohol. Want some water? Chit chat. Let me know if there's anything to drink. If you need anything to drink. Something on your mind? What sort of work do you do here? I'm mixing my life and changing the alcohol. Wait, I think that's the other way around. I'm just an average bartender working in the most expensive place in the world. What brings you to this very expensive train? I thought you were listening to our conversation. I stopped listening when it got boring. I'm going to be an apprentice at the witch's house in the highlight. After working as an apprentice for three years, I'll be able to graduate from the school for witches. 
Wow, Highline, huh? That's a right proper place, isn't it? So they say. That's probably why you got the ticket for free. You must be someone special. I'm gonna... I feel like this is a sort of game where, kind of, me being here, right here, is not really super fitting, so I'm gonna turn off my webcam. Hope that's okay with everybody. I disappeared. I'm not. You cannot see me anymore. <laughs> I don't really care about that kind of thing, though. That kind of thing is what's at, what's important at the end of the day. It's best to just suck it up. You'll be glad you did it later down the road, you know? Yeah, later. Something on your mind? Why are you working here as bartender and not at shop? I used to own the bar. In this area? Sure did. My wife and I, the two of us. Whoa, you're both bartenders. I met her at work, after all. Robin, gone, art. No, I'm not gone! I'm just visibly not here. <laughs> Stop it. We had to move due to circumstances, though, so here we are now. I hope a time comes when the, when the two of you open up shop again. What's up? It's nice to know. Um, no training. Goodbye. Or goodbye. <laughs> okay. Nice that we got- they have Starry Night over there! Nice. Okay, we can't go that way. Da -da 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 -da. What's up, everybody? I'm gonna ask you. Up ahead is the engine room. Uh, question. Lace-up boots. We don't check the passenger's outfit. Even if you don't check it, it's inconvenient to get it off it if you wear strappy boots. There's so many different types of clothing that cause discomfort. I can't define them all. And what about having a hard time taking off your shoes when you get off? Delays occur once in a while due to their shoes, but then again, it's not regulated. Yes, there's no fine. Isn't it a matter of harming social reputation rather than the fine? Is that so? Up ahead is the engine room. Uh, shit, shit. Small talk is forbidden during operation. Uh, shop. Please save any inquiries regarding souvenirs at the station until after we exit the train. Uh, I'm an attendant of the Brightman Railroads. My job is to ensure the passengers' comfort and safety. Okay, that's it. No, 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 no. Okay. Uh, and. Hey, what's up? Ordinary passenger. Hello. No. I don't know why I'm giving everyone <laughs> voices, but. Am I disturbing you? Negative. What's the issue? Oh, I want to ask you about something. You're on the way to High Lion, right? Perfect. Um... What's the matter? I don't know why they have this voice, but they just do. Oh, it's just that you have a very blunt way of speaking. The wolf kinda... <laughs> You sound like the janitor from my school. Why does your janitor have such a grisly eh, voice? Well, I used to be a soldier. So what brings you here? Speak. No voice? Before that. What? I've been staring at my feet for a while. Is there some kind of problem? Oh, I was gonna ask anyway. Isn't it uncomfortable to wear such strappy boots? Take some time. Take them off. Then it would be hard for you when you, when you arrive at Highline. What are you talking about? I mean, you have to take your shoes off when you get off. Get off. What? 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 Huh? You were kidding? I'm sorry. I'm rather dull when it comes to things like this. Jenny! Mr. Bartender! The mystery has been solved. Did I make some kind of mistake? No, oh, no. I just realized that I was deceived. I remember now. It's a joke to make fun of people who visit Highland for the first time. Stop! You don't have to kill me twice by giving that much detail. Sorry. Are you holding back laughter? No, I'm not. <laughs> no, I wouldn't, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't do that. <laughs> He's trying so hard to... Trying so hard to be considerate of you. Don't ask twice. 
Virgil, I hate you even more now. You don't need to be too upset. This went there for the first time in the past. It was also tricked by a colleague and took him off. That doesn't comfort me at all. Sorry. How do you feel? Why are you asking me that? Your molars might fall out. <laughs> Relax a bit and tell me. I can't believe Jenny to see me. There's a reason why she's your friend. Now go back to your seat quietly and wait until we've arrived. I forgot what voice we had. Wolf is to stick cause slash jade. Fair enough. We still have three more days to go. Three more days? This is as terrible as the smell of spotted shiitake mushrooms. Alright, so are we just gonna go sit down now? Are we gonna be sitting in our chair for three days? That's a long time. It's the only pleasure on the train. Alright, now have some patience and stay seated. Well, now we know. Don't take off shoes. I'm bored. You just sat down. This is torture. Stare out the window if you're so bored. Yeah, look outside. Look at that mountain. It must be hiding a cave with strange pillars, statues, and a giant door. Sounds like the prologue to a story where you awaken a terrible demon. Wait, hold on, Virgil. Shut up and look out the window. The summit of the mountain. There's a gigantic shining tree at the top. Me too, Ellie. <laughs> a gigantic shining tree? Why is it shining? Does it have a luminous flowers? It must be beautiful up close. Give it up. This train won't stop for two days. Uh, I want to get out now. I hope we crash. Bad chance of that happening, so just stay bored. After all, you signed up for three years of even more boredom. Also, Virgil is so cute, right? Aren't there any crush crocophants? Crocophants? Nope. What about boa constrictors? This isn't a jungle. Train robbers? This isn't the Wild West. It's a healing game, remember? Hey, a boa constrictor. The correct line is, what's going on? There's no station here. Why are we stopping? Not sure. Maybe there's something wrong with the tree. Doubt it's a boa constrictor, though. I don't care if it's not a boa constrictor. Please just say that there's some massively critical issue. Please, please, please. We apologize for the inconvenience. A critical issue, perhaps? The train cannot continue its journey due to a critical issue. Yes! Attention! The train will stop until tomorrow morning and the departure time. Can we go outside? We will likely be announced tomorrow. We will depart immediately if possible. Okay, I'll be back in a bit. In the meantime, please avoid wandering too far from the train. Let's go! I'm not sure if you remember, but... Of course I remember. The shining tree is at the peak. No, not that. We have to get back by tomorrow morning. Then we should get going! Alright, let's go see the- let's check out this tree! Hell ye. Wow, it's so dark. If you're scared, we can go back to the train. I love it! Let's hurry. Memo board. I think- Wait, are- They look connected here. Okay, they're not actually- Hey, bartender, do you have anything to say about the whole situation? You know why the train stopped all of a sudden? I've been here with you the whole time. I know as much as you. Does the train stop often? No, never. Time is money. If there's no good reason, it never stops. When they fix the problem, I'm sure we'll take off right away. The crew member just said we'll be leaving tomorrow morning. Oh, then I guess we're leaving tomorrow morning. Want some water? I may not look the part, but I used to be quite the big deal back in the day. Anyone ask? Virgil shut up. You must have been very, you must have been very popular. There were customers who'd visit the bar just to see me. Even to this day, I still take pride in these eyebrows of mine. They are fantastic eyebrows. After all, even my wife said she fell in love with them. I love all the little voices. Thank you. Thank you. Well, a romantic tale that just that starts with eyebrows. What's up? Uh, that's it. Goodbye. All right, bye, buddy. Let's see. 
Sorry, you can't go beyond here. Why did the train stop? There is something in the train's path. We're working on getting rid of whatever is in the way. Something in the way? Is it a boa constrictor? A boa constrictor? No, no. It's a strange prickly vine. Strange prickly vine. Yes, a strange prickly vine. It wasn't there yesterday, but it seems to have grown overnight. We can't seem to cut it with a regular axe, but we're doing our best. We've contacted the witches, so I'm sure they'll be he here to help in no time. Can I take a look? I happen to be a witch. But I happen to be a witch. You're our passenger. It's our responsibility to make sure you're safe. We'll take care of it, so please be patient. Can I just take a peek? I'm sorry. That's fine. Oh, we can go say we can go say hi to. No, we can't. Let's go say hi to him. All right, let's go check out the tree. It's a hill. Won't be easy to climb. Look over there. There are vines hanging on the hill. I'll be able to climb that much. That's bad news. It's a secret passageway, Virgil. I don't think it's a secret or passageway. I bet there's a path beyond here. Oh, I never changed the category. Oh my goodness. Being a little witch in the little woods. Little witch in the woods. There we go. No spoilers. Okay. Alright, so... Squishy chub, pumpkin terry... I don't know what that's about. Okay. Alright, let's go look for the train. What's this? Looks like a little honey pumpkin. What's that? It's a type of weed that grows in the forested areas. I don't know why I changed the voice. I don't know! It's... It's a type of weed! No, that's horrible. That's horrible. Ah. Um... It's a type of weed. <laughs> it's a type of weed that grows in the forested gardens. The vines grow so fast that you can never get rid of them by hand. You must find the nucleus hidden somewhere to get rid of it. And I guess we can also get rid of this if we find the nucleus. Or just return to the train quietly. That can't happen. Let's go look for the nucleus. It must be nearby. Since the nucleus gives off light when you touch the vine, you'll be able to find it. Right, so we go. I see. Me. That's kind of cute. Okay. Great, it's time to explore. Please don't use that word. Explore? That word gives me anxiety. No thanks to your mother. All right, let's go explore. <laughs> we just, I love our little waddle. And then... <laughs> it's great. We get acquiring crayon apple. Oh, yeah. The shining tree is the peak of the mountain, so go quickly if you want to see it. We must return to the train by tomorrow morning. Yeah, yeah. This game is in early access. So that's why there's typos still. Okay, but I want to get this app Cran Apple first. And the witch flower. Okay. It's not like the timer's ticking or anything. You can just calm down a little bit, Virgil. Virgil! Please! I get it. I get it. You want me to go? I don't catch typos because I I make them so often my brain automatically corrects. Honestly, I I can just kind of struggle a little bit reading typos. So sometimes it's just it's just how it is. Okay. Where do we, I'm going towards the shiny tree. Please, Virgil, stop yelling at us. It's too dark and worn down for me to see anything. I don't see any words, only pictures. Let's come back when it's brighter. Shining tree. Oh my god, Virgil! I get it! If I ever type anything illegible, just let me know. 
I'll let you know, yeah, don't worry. Don't have the right chalk. Okay. Alright, uh, I guess we're just gonna ring some bells. We have to go to Highland. What a shame. I know, Virgil! I'm aware of this! Yeah, we have to go from that direction. Fine, whatever. Um... Yes, I am aware of this virtual. My god. Well, that's not the right direction. This is where I came from. I'm trying to figure out how to get there, Virgil. Can you please calm down a little bit? Virgil, please. I'm begging you to get off my ass. I can't go anywhere! Ever? All the paths are blocked! Oh my goodness, Virgil. Like, okay, what? Like, it seems like it would be on the far left and up, but it was blocked off that way. going that way again. Oh, now it's letting me go through. <laughs> this is the first direction I try- Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. That's a bad thing, right? I always hated mountains. My leather gets worn out from all the wind. Okay, Virgil. See what's mine I take ye. Okay. Oh, uh, I don't know. Uh, this way. We're going this way. Got a dangle mango. It's not all it's chalked up to be. Ha ha. Ha ha. Okay, not that direction. Why are 
are there so many things blocking the path? That's a good question. This must be a forest with many secrets. What's this? Looks like a barrier made with a witch pattern. Witch pattern? Is there a witch here? There was, or... Do you know how it works? School hammered it into my head. Shouldn't be an issue, long as it's drawn well. Okay, so now I can go through them? Okay. Wow, it's the gigantic shining tree! The same one that we saw from the train! It's a bitter grape tea tree. I don't think the tree is the one that's shining. Check this out, Virgil! There are tons of butterflies on it. You're right. The butterflies seem to be glowing. These are blooming butterflies. The butterflies give off a subtle moonlight. The light from these butterflies has the same power as the actual moonlight. That's why strange things always happen around these butterflies. Aren't they beautiful? A giant tea tree with butterflies glowing with moonlight. It's not just beautiful. It's an extremely fascinating sight to behold. Isn't this pr a pretty magnificent discovery? Did you know that those two are rare creatures? What? So what about it? The fact that those two are together is amazing. What about those two being together? What two? What are you talking about? The, the tree and the butterflies? They're usually raised together artificially to get moonflower and lucerine or two. It's uncommon for them to be together naturally like this. Um, anyway, we did find something, right? Yes. I'll have to write a letter to the school later. Let's look around a bit. Fill up the codex and, and all, right? Don't be late. We must return to the train by tomorrow morning. Okay. Let's go back the way we came up. There might be other strange things. Is time going to progress? Yeah. So we're good. It's getting late, so I gotta bounce. Love you so much. Thank you so much. I hope you have a wonderful rest. Talk to you later, worm. Bye! If there's anywhere I can sleep to for tonight. What about on the ground? The dirt and, dirt and rock should make for a nice bed. That's not funny, Virgil. Don't sleep in the flowers, please. You're gonna miss your train. Look, the blue moon butterfly we saw at the peak is here, too. Might as well collect some for study purposes. You think I could just sneak up and grab it? Wait, do you remember what Miss Gravier said? Death lives under the bed? No, not that. Draw it before you touch it. That's right. So... Switch between encyclopedia and quilt. Gotcha. Approach it and use the quilt to draw it in the encyclopedia. Okay. Draw it with the quilt. Open the encyclopedia. And it's softly glow, sensitive sound, but not easily go away unless it feels special. Habitat and time of appearance. Tool used for collecting. And what tool set can you require? Alright, cool. Great, it's registered in the catalog. Now let's see. Now, do you see why you can't catch any right now? It's the tool. Hmm, so you can collect them using a butterfly net. I don't have one right now. Not much you can do now, then. But I want to do it right now. Getting to the witch's house in the High Lion is more important. Hmm. Let's go back down now. There's gotta be something else that's fun. I'm just gonna remove these a whole bunch. You can temporarily get rid of the vines with the weed terminator potion, but they'll grow back after a while. Then what do I do? Find the core. Should be somewhere near the vines. Well, I can't get to it, so... Screw me, I guess. Ooh, yes. Draw with okay. Wait, no, I want to draw it. Okay. I'm just going to get all the codex of these. Draw it before you touch it. Let me hop down. Okay, draw it. I guess not. Alrighty then. 
Again, it was S. No. Which flower? You just often use this flower when making things, hence the name which flower. Grab this stem and give a sight to the time to pull from the ground. Yay! Okay. Right. Note down everything. <laughs> Please write about you. No. Okay. All right. I guess we'll just head out then. <gasps> it's a cat. Oh well. Ellie, let's go back to the train. Look at that, Virgil. It's a shining white cat. Never seen anything like that before. Ellie, we have to. Let's go after that creature. No, we're going to go back to the train. Let's focus on what we're doing right now. No, we got it. Okay. Well. Got to see. Hi, cat. Why has the cat got a bubble on its head? have the right shock. Oh, is this the right shock? I think that, that the cat dropped something and left. What's this? It's like a witch chalk. That's the thing you use to draw things like a pattern. It looks like a little different from the one we were using at school. It's just a different packaging. Yeah, this this chalk is branded Walmart. <laughs> it's Walmart chalk. The one we got at school. No, the one that we got at school is Walmart chalk. This chalk right here is um I don't know. special chalk. What are chalk companies? Why am I looking this up? Chalk. Shopping. <laughs> Let's see. Alright, the the one we got at school was crazy art chalk, and this is Rayola chalk right here. It's the good shit. It won't work if it gets erased like this. You can always draw the same pa pattern again using the same color point chalk. Since I have the one I just picked up earlier, let's draw it again with that. Should I draw the witch's pattern again with yeah. Yes. Alright, choose the witch's pattern again. Oh wait, does that use up the chalk? That's so that's that's a lot of chalk being used. Huh? Where did the cat go? Look, Virgil, there's a house. It's a witch's house, isn't it? Looks pretty old. I guess we can talk to the master witch here and stay here for a while. It doesn't look like there are people inside. If there's no one, I might stay for a while. Isn't it natural for an apprentice witch to be at a witch's house? That's true, but... Or we can leave. Can we go back to the train? I should, I, I should look inside it. I wasn't expecting it to let us actually leave. Because it wasn't letting us leave earlier. Anyone there? Is anybody there? Seems like nobody's here. Could be an abandoned witch's house. Because the witch administration can't figure out everything. Alright, let's go inside. Oh. Really is an abandoned witch's house. Taking that into consideration, it looks okay, although it's not that clean, since the witch's house is managed on her own. 
doesn't seem to be in a very good condition considering how dirty it is. But the bed looks fine. I guess I can just sleep here. Um, well, since the witch's house is a public institution, it's okay to sleep on sleep one night or so. It's better than sleeping outside. Well, if we sleep in here, we're not gonna we're, we're we're not gonna wake up in time for the train. I guarantee it. All right, well, let's sleep here. <laughs> Um, what's with that face? You slept on a nice fluffy bed. Yes, but I dreamt that I was sleeping on the train. All that effort not to sleep on the train only drew just that. You should have just slept on the train. No, that's not it. I slept very well, actually. I can almost hear the sound of the train, though. Wait, isn't that actually the sound of the train? What? Really? Is it taking off already? Let's hurry. <laughs> yeah, we got, we got run. It really is the sound, it really is the sound of the train. I think it's about to take off. Let's hurry back. Woke up just in time. Glad I didn't sleep in. Run! Run! Little squishy lads. They're so cute. Run! I'm sure we're not going to make it to the train. But run! Huh? Where's the train? Huh. Looks like that bird was imitating train sounds. But where's the train? Probably went to Highland. And what do we do now? Let's look around the area. I'm sure we'll find some clues. Why are you so calm? Been through much worse with your mom. Damn. What is that thing? It's called the Gaga Bird. It says, they say it's a bit insane. Quiet, I don't want to hear it. Your fault for oversleeping. Don't blame the Gaga bird. Fine, whatever. Just be quiet. Reggie. A letter. How nice of them to leave a letter behind. Let's see. I think it's from the bartender on the train. You're probably shocked to see the train is gone. A witch suddenly appeared in the middle of the night and got rid of the prickly vines. They said they can't wait because the train was already delayed. So we had to leave. But don't worry, the train will come back and there's a village nearby where I used to live. You can just spend some time there. There should be a sign in the forest, so take a look and go find the village. When you arrive at the village, please send in Enit in 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 and Arden my regards. Bartender. That's the pl that place we saw earlier must be a village. Are you even a little upset that we missed the train, Ellie? It's okay since there is a village, right? I guess we can just wait there. How about cleaning the witch's house? We must get rid of that the prickly vines at the village entrance. Okay. Please try not to sound so excited. We missed the train, remember? Right. You heard me, right? Well then, might as well add more to the encyclopedia now. Might as well. Uh, can we just walk on the train tracks? No. Okay. Fair enough. I mean, I was right. I, <laughs> I guess it's just a little obvious, but still, I don't know. This game's so cute. Got lovely music. Oh, time is passing by. Okay. They turned on the timer. <laughs> okay, so we need to go. You're so cute! Look at you! You're so cute! Squishy Chub. Oh, I love him. <laughs> Burrows and lives underground in groups of two to four. As curious creatures, they approach people first, should someone come near them. Pinching and squeezing their comfy cheeks will leave tufts of soft fur in your hands. Aww. Hi. How are you guys doing? I'll pick you up. <laughs> I just grab it and just stretch it. Okay, thank you for letting me stretch you. 
All right, let's clean up the house. Let's get rid of the weed first. There's too much. Take forever to pull out all this out using hands. Take a look over at the pit over there. We might have a potion to get rid of the weed. There's nothing in here. Then we'll have to use another tool. There, is there another tool? Yes, there's a wonderful tool. What's that? Your hands. Ah. Welcome back, Rabbity. We're just gonna pull all these weeds real quick. I do enjoy pulling weeds in games, you know. It, it is very satisfying. You can just press a button. It's gone. Gonna make this house look great. So lately, Rowan has been playing uh, Stardew Valley. They got the demo, and I was like, you know, if you get the demo, you're gonna get addicted to it and end up buying the game. And they were like, ah! and I was like, okay, okay. They played it. They've been playing it a whole bunch lately, and it's been really fun to watch them. And then the demo ended, so not to be like I told you so, but I was. <laughs> they ended up buying the game today, so. Stardew Valley is just a very addicting game, but it's a very good game from what I hear. I haven't actually played it yet, but I hear it's good. I and mean, it was fun to watch Rowan play. So, I think we got all the weeds. We? Oh, we just need to clean that up. When people get Stardew Valley, one of the first things I ask is whether or not they've gotten addicted to the fishing yet. <laughs> um, I don't think Rowan really likes the fishing, honestly. But, yeah. Also, by the way, I, I have it set so that ads trigger every hour, and um, so another ad's gonna hit in like three to four minutes, by the way, everyone. Just so you know, I'm, I don't know how to check exactly when. I just know that I can, I can see when the last ad was, you know. Most people, including me, get addicted to fishing. Fair enough. It does seem fun. I do. The fishing seems fun. It's nice to see that is clean. Now it's time to tidy up the house. Ah, right. I'm really, I, I, I really have not been sticking to the voice for that. At, look, Ellie, it's the quest book. All I see is dust and cobwebs that we have to clean up. Exactly. Let's find something useful while cleaning. Oh, it's a note. Be useful later. She really messed up the house. Reminds me of your room. My room was cleaner than this. That might be so from a dust standpoint. I wonder where the witch is. The one who lived here. This place is probably very old. She must be eating and living well somewhere in Lucerne or two. It's a witch bookshelf. Technically, it's a bookshelf that the witch was using. That's the same as a witch bookshelf. I'm not going to read a book, though. I'm tired of books. Poisonous mushroom is better than a witch who doesn't read books. What does that mean? Because a poisonous mushroom kills just one person. Stop nagging. I read enough books at school. Hmm. Witch history. The Twelve Plants. Fun book of plants. Gardening for witches. There are so many books on plants. I guess the witch you used to research plants was living here. I should store any books I get here. All done clean. It's also messy in front of the desk there, over there, Ellie. Stop bossing me around like a teacher. I finally managed to get out of school. There's some dust over there, Ellie. Don't leave food behind, Ellie. I told you not to go inside the principal's office, Ellie. You should have listened. Oh, this is a witch elevator. Why you have to listen to the teachers. Let's hurry up and go down. What if there's a scary monster? You think so? Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, so we can go down. I, oh, this was the last spot we needed. <laughs> wow, 
Oh, look at this, Virgil. This must be the dispensary. You can probably make potions with the proper tools. We should definitely do some cleaning. Well, cleaning again. Do you actually like cleaning in video games? I don't like cleaning in real life, but <laughs> I know what this is. It's an extractor. We used it so many times in school. It was slightly smaller. It's, it was a slightly smaller one, though. What is that? It's just a bit of gunk on the ground. <laughs> Speaking of gunk, cleaning. Uh, it would be hard to use. Look at the glass bottle underneath. Oh, that's true. It's broken. I'll need a friendly toad at least. I'm squeaky clean ish. Hell yeah. I'll need I'll need to get a glass bottle first in order to use this. We need to at least fix the extractor in order to make potions. All right, let's go to the village first. Let's look for one. But let's finish cleaning first. This box looks pretty useful. I'm stained by hair dye. Ooh, did you did you dye your hair? What color? I'm. I, you don't have to post a selfie or, or anything. But I'm just curious. What color did you dye your hair? Oh, and add. Apologies. How are you guys doing? Uh, subs. Are you guys doing? Good. That probably shouldn't call you guys that. <laughs> Thank you, subscribers, for supporting my content. And yeah, I appreciate it. How are you guys doing? You guys having a good, having a good time, enjoying this game. I hope everyone's doing good. Okay, everyone should be getting back in fifteen seconds. Get a drink, drink. I'm good. How are you? I'm doing good. Doing good. All right. Welcome back, everybody. Thank you for watching the ads and supporting my content. And yeah, I really appreciate it. Okay. This box looks pretty useful. I can put stuff in here when my pockets are full. Okay, I don't think I need all of this. Last Thursday, I went to the hair place and got it dyed and bleached, so it's bright red. Hell yeah! That's awesome! Dangle mangle. Oh yeah, we already got it. Okay, let's move that over in the maple layer. Let's just move all of this. Nice. Okay. Can I, can I clean the book? I guess not. Okay. A roaster? Ugh, oh, I hate this thing. You have to put it in the ingredient or put in the ingredients and just wait. It's off. Can't you simply put them in and do something else while you're waiting? It seems to be in a bad condition now. Really? Oh yes, there's no handle for winding the spring. Where would I get a roaster hand? I don't need the roaster since it's, it is not needed for a basic recipe. And there should be something when you get to the village. Yeah, the village comes first. By the way, there's nothing normal here. It would be rather strange to be normal when it's dirty like this. Maple herb extract. Interesting. Wow, this is a pretty good cauldron. I think it was made by the Blue Lightning Workshop. Its style is very traditional. I've only ever used the cheap cauldrons at school. Finally, I get to use a good one. You remember how to use one? Expertly processed ingredients, the same, the exact heat intensity, and the right ladling technique. And at last, at last, you'll end up with the proper potions. For order craft potions, you need to follow the required ingredients, fire setting, ladle direction, and carefully review the recipes in this time. Actually, I liked Teacher Olivia. Still, the cauldron looks fine. You'll be able to make a potion even if you have the ingredients. Machine tools are in bad condition, though. Since there are some discarded ingredients, let's make the potion we need using them for now. Extracts. This is a potion ingredient, isn't it? You've used them in school countless times. Are witches usually this sloppy? Sloppy or not, they're careful with their ingredients. 
then I guess the witch that lived here was really sloppy. Or she was in a hurry. Why? Beats me. Okay. Uh, let's clean this up. Spilled bottle, scribbled paper, and book. What a mess. Just brush off the dust. Just brushing off the dust might take a lifetime. What's this? Lunar's oil? Looks like a recipe for a potion. I guess it was used by the witch who was here. It reads, a potion with the power of the moon. The ingredients are moonflower and phoenix feather. I have fire red hair. Hell yeah! Alright. See you in a bit, Ravi. I'll use it someday. Let's have it ready for now. There is also something underneath. Where? Oh, you're right! Um, I don't know what kind of text this is. You learned it at school. It's the ancient witch language. You mean I learned how to read these strange symbols? Your score wasn't bad either. I don't remember anything. Shall we take a look anyways? Um, looks like a recipe. Seems like moon something. I have no idea. I got a headache. Take a look if you remember later. Old memo written in unintelligible language. I think it, I learned the language a while ago, but I can't. Yeah, I should put it away and revisit it later. This desk would be nice to use as a workbench work later. There's no use for it now. Okay. All done cleaning. We can make potions now. It'd be hard to make properly because the machine tools are broken. Since there were ingredients on the ground, let's try making them for now. There's a little honey pumpkin in front of the village. A stubborn weed eliminator potion, elimination potion should do it, right? It's a weed terminator potion. Whatever. Check the recipe in the encyclopedia. You'll probably be, you'll probably be able to make it with the ingredients you were lucky enough to find. Alright, let's do it. We're gonna make a potion. Weed terminator. Stay easy. Stage four heat. Don't stir. Put two squishy chub fur in an extractor. Squeeze the juice. Okay, we already got the fur extract and we already got the witch flower extract. Set fire stage four. Pour it in. Okay. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Processing the collectible, put the ingredients in the witch's pot and adjust the fire and label the as needed to craft. Okay. So, ingredients you pick up while cleaning ingredients are, are ingredients, so you can craft potions with the, from them right away. Try crafting the weed terminator potion using witch flower extract and squishy chub fur extract. Okay. It was this one and this one. So cute! Oh, I loved that animation. That was so cute. Weed Terminator potion. To make best use of this potion, it is best to know what unwanted plant you are targeting. It is most effective on garden weeds. Awesome! The stubborn weed extermination potion is complete. It's a potion for removing weeds. Anyway, it's ready. Let's go throw it at the little honey pumpkin. You must use it carefully since there are no more ingredients. Okay, don't worry. You must throw it at the little honey pumpkin and make sure to remove the nucleus as well, because weed terminator potion is just a temporary mission. Got it. Off we go. And save and load. Oh, audience. Let's save. And now take naps. You cannot nap at night, and you can only nap once per day. Okay. Welcome back, Rabbity. This game's so cute! Let's take a nap for now. That did nothing. I was hoping that would regenerate our health. It, or our stamina. It did not. I posted when I went to the zoo. Nice. Yeah, you did. I, I don't know what you mean, but... Aim. Okay, probably don't want to stand by it when we throw it. And 
and grow. <laughs> Here it goes! Good, I think it's working properly. Let's pass by quickly and find the nucleus in the meantime. I don't know if we'll be able to find the nucleus, I'm not sure about that one. <laughs> huh, this isn't a village. Look over there, Ellie. It's a prickly vine this time. It's so huge and thick. Oh no, what do I do with the extractor? First, take a look around here. Hi, Aria. Hello, do you live in the town? Nature is so beautiful. What? Aren't the trees beautiful? Their green leaves are so pretty. Oh, uh, sure. Nature is so breathtaking. You must love nature. How can you not? Okay, I'll be back. Walk under the blue sky and experience nature. She must really love nature. So much that she can't have a conversation? You should respect her interests. I think it's more of an obsession. <laughs> something didn't feel right. You think she's cursed or something? A curse that doesn't allow her. It's party time. <laughs> a curse that doesn't allow her to talk about anything except nature? A curse of the nature lover? That doesn't make any sense. There are lots of quirky witches out there. First, the cursed looking candy that can lift the curse should be a basic recipe. Oh, but we can't use the machine tool now. We must process what we, what's been collected to make a potion. What should I do? You picked up several ingredients at the workplace earlier, didn't you? Those would be enough to make cursed lifting candy. And did you see what's next to her over there? Next to her? What? It's a glass bottle that would be perfect as a glass extractor bottle. Where? Whoa, you weren't kidding. All right, let's make a curse lifted candy to lift the curse. And to receive that glass bottle as a reward. That would be nice. First, let's check on the candy that I, that can lift the curse in the book. Lunar is oil. Potion that glows soft in moonlight. It's lovely silvery light. Not only gives you moon's power, but also useful to set a romantic blue. Is that the anti-curse one? It doesn't seem like an anti-curse potion. Oh wait, no, it was candy, 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 candy. Curse looking candy. Okay, that's what we want. Not this, this. That's right, that's right, because we picked up the recipe for it. Okay. Candy that can relieve a light curse, such as a curse that makes you forget to brush your teeth, or a curse that makes you fall often. The sweet mint flavor of this candy is delicious. Uh, maple herb extractors, fire stage three, Stir. Don't stir. Okay. How do I set the fire level? Take a look at that huge prickly vine. Okay, I apologize. I guess I'm not done here yet. Wow, they really are big. Too big for the weed terminator potion, I think. Hmm. We'll have to do something else. We'll have to stay at the witch's house for a while. Okay. Mysteria. The village is just ahead. Well, not for us. Anything down here? There's just a little bunch of little guys. Just a bunch of little squishy guys. There's some candy. Give me the owl thing? What owl thing? I don't know what you mean. Squish you. You will also be squished. Okay. Bye! Thank you for letting me squish you. <laughs> Do the work nice. Pull the lever, Kronk! I must change the glass bottle to use the extra- well- that's what I wanted to do. Um, uh, uh, am I stupid? I might be stupid. I 
I, I, I want to. I want to use the glass bottle. Do I need to go to the cauldron? Oh, wait. I forgot. I don't have the glass bottle. I am stupid. No stirring. And we can crack. Curse lifting king. I'm a rogue gamer. Hell yeah. So what is this game about? Uh ooh. I think we're kind of, we've already kind of gotten the main gist of what this game's about. I think it's about um, being a witch and making potions and stuff. And trying I'm assuming we're trying to figure out what's causing this big prickly vine and stop it. Shall I give her the crystal looking candy? Yes. Would you like to try this? May the blessings of nature be with you. Hello? Yes, hello. Am I speaking properly now? Yes, I think so. Now, thank you so much. To hell with nature. <laughs> I guess it really was a curse. <laughs> I can tell that the old man I met in the western jungle was suspicious just by looking at him. I, <laughs> I profiled the shit out of that man. <laughs> yeah, I could simply couldn't ignore such a well-made wooden image of a monkey. After I bought it, I could only talk about praising nature. I tried to speak backwards, right, but I could only praise nature for pure torture. I hope nature just rots and dies. Still, I'm glad the curse was easily removed. What the fuck, Aria? Well, thank you so much. My name is Aria. How long has it been since I've said my name? My name is Ellie. I'm an apprentice witch. Oh, did you come to this town to be an apprentice? I was on the train, but I got off for a moment and it left without me. Oh dear! I was about to enter- Oh wait, I was about to enter the town, but I was blocked off by some prickly vines. Damn nature! <laughs> Thankfully, we found an empty witch's house nearby, so I've been staying there. An empty? Oh yes, there's a witch's house here. That's good. I have business in the village too, but the vines stopped me. Nature be damned. I'll be here for a while, so let me know if you need anything. Speaking of nature, Rob, in which channel should I post pictures I took of just like nature in the Discord? Ooh, um, that's a good question. I don't know, that, I, I would consider that art. So yeah. Also, your hair looks great, Ninetail. I just looked in the selfies channel. Your hair looks great. I love it. Oh, then can I ask you a favor? Not a favor, but a fair price. What do you need? The tools were broken when I was trying to use the dispensary at the witch's house. Do you have any tools or parts? What kind of tools or parts do you need? I need a glass bottle for the extractor and a roaster hander for winding the roaster. Wait a minute, I'll look for them. Sure. Wait, do you have any money? I do. Mom gave me money when I was. My, they gave me pocket money when I came out. You think you'll be able to buy witch's tools with just enough pocket money? To buy a snack too? Ah, uh, is that so? What if I don't have enough money? Since you have tools, make, make and sell potions or something. You can always also sell candies. Only if there are people to buy them. Take this. Last extra. It was right next to us. It was, it was right next to us. I don't know why it took you so long to find it. Never mind. This is just... This is return for breaking my curse. Oh, thank god. Fortunately, I don't have any roaster handle for the roaster. You see, will you be staying at the village? If so, I'll bring it next time. I'll sell it at a proper price then, however. Good, please bring it then. Okay, I'll write roaster handle in the memo. Oh, and take this too. Ooh, the cute and cute. Since the price for the bottle earlier wasn't enough, I'll give you this as well. Thank you. Sure. Come back next time. Now we'll be able to fix the extractor. Are you really going to stay in this village? I should until the train comes. Really? I have no choice. No, I mean, are you really going to leave when the train comes? That? I'll decide when that happens. Let's just fix the extractor first. 
fair, fair. It's it's a Stardew Valley. Can I pull these weeds? It's a Stardew Valley moment. Move in. Be like, oh, we'll move. I'll leave later. Yeah, I need. <laughs> All right, let's fix that extractor. Can use extra. We can finally make potions tougher. And what do I do now? Didn't you want to go to the village? She removed the giant prickly thing. That's true, but it seems impossible to get rid of that huge thing with the recipe I have. The basic recipe does seem to be seem kind of inadequate. What's your plan? Now that the extractor has been fixed, you'll be able to make potions from the basic recipes. If you make weed terminated potion, you can get rid of the little honey pumpkin. I'll be able to go to the places that I have been blocked. A little more, yeah, so the forest. Let's look through the forest. There must be something. That's what I'm saying. Okay. What was the recipe for the weed extractor? What was it? E? Don't know. Pumpkin terrier. That's the pumpkin terrier. They're so cute! Oh, I could have grabbed some fur. I was worried about it biting me. <laughs> okay. Um. Got it. We terminate. That's what it is. Sunlight function. Use that to run away. Gotcha. We terminator. Okay. Two squishy chub fur and two witch flower. We have enough of them, I'm sure. <laughs> Just jump up and pull the pull the lava cronk. I had to go for a second. Which channel should I post it in? Uh, I would say art, probably, because it's a it's a photo, and that's kind of art, you know. Okay. Boop, boop. Uh, yeah, just like that. I love this animation so much. It's such a cute animation. It's a witch's crow. The witch returns. The witch returns. This is my first time coming here, though. The witch returns. <gasps> Maybe. The witch returns. Uh, you can make a photography channel or something. Ah, uh, no, nah, I think art is fine. I think art's fine for that. People, com people, people complain a little bit that there are already too many channels, so I don't want to add more. <laughs> so, not exactly a listener, is he? Goods and services! Goods and services! Witch's catalog! The witch's catalog? I've always wanted to try it out. I need to head towards Highline, young lady. But I can't just starve until I reach the village. After I find the village, I'm gonna make sure to try it out before I go to Highline. Leverage it time only! Register now for a gift! Come on! Try the witch's catalog! Try the witch's catalog! They're handing out gifts as well! Plus it's limited time only! multi-purpose multi glue, kitchen accessories, a spork. In any case, I need the witch's catalog. I guess it wouldn't hurt to have it in, in a pinch. You can buy ingredients or potion recipes from them. All right, let's register for now. Thank you! Thank you! Better for ye! Better for ye! Ha! Better for ye! Also, I... There... Th Art, the arts channel is not just for drawings or stuff like that. It's also for like music and so I just wanted to say that. Wait, is Jessica streaming right now? Jessica's streaming right now. I didn't even realize that. That's odd. <laughs> Alright, well, we're gonna keep playing for a little while longer, but we'll probably raid Jessica. Uh, we're done. So, you. 
<laughs> exactly. We found a crow. Wait. Work finished. Work finished. Close for the day. Close for the day. Okay. So suddenly, it's not easy getting the message across to the witch's crows. Hmm. Then I guess I should keep searching for the village. You never know when the witch's catalog will show up. Let's stick to the plan and find the village. Okay. Wait, but we're not trying to find the village, are we? We already found the village earlier. Alright, I'm... No, I want to squish you. I want to squish you. Let me squish you. I want to squish you. Get back over here so I can squish you. I gotta squish you. Get back over here. There, there we go. I squished him. So, if we go for another pumpkin patch thing, then we should be able to break it! Excuse me. No, oh, that's just chalk. Nope, this is also chalk. Where do we go then? Maybe up this way? Oh wait, there was the other direction. That's where our house is. Oh wait, but that's where the tree was. This was the tree. Where, where else can we possibly go? I'll remember. Okay, that's where we live at the moment. I guess we can go to the tree. something over here. Maybe there was something I missed over here. Virgil, look at that. It's grown so much. It wasn't that big a while ago. That must be an adult honey pumpkin. Better get rid of it before it grows anymore. What? I'm not even a gardener. Why? Must get rid of it to get a new place to a new place since we haven't been behind it. I guess it can't be helped to get to the new place. I guess I should make a wee turn. I already did! Simple because I made it once before. You made it twice before! Don't forget to remove the new place if you want to avoid repeating the same thing. I guess I should make that potion. Yeet. <laughs> this game's cute. I like it. It's a little bit janky at the moment, but that's kind of to be expected, you know? Why is there something in that spider web? I really hope that's not a spider in the spider web. There's someone stuck in the spider whip. I think he's lost consciousness. Is he even alive? I don't know. Um, yeah. He woke up. I'm Ellie, an apprentice witch. A witch? Wow, this is my first time seeing an apprentice witch. It's my first time seeing someone caught in a spider web. What boy should we do for them? A oh, boy. Maybe like a Mickey Mouse voice. <laughs> Or movie. I don't know. <laughs> My name is Rebrum. 
I live in the village with my grandma. That's the voice for him. But now I'm stuck in a big spider web. Well, they, why do you look happy about it? <laughs> Doesn't seem to understand the gravity of this situation. A big spider web means there's a big spider nearby. Please tell me there's not a big spider actually nearby. <gasps> you be quiet. Don't worry, you'll be fine. I'll help you down. You have to be careful when you're dealing with spider webs, Ellie. Looks pretty strong. One wrong move and you'll get stuck in it yourself. And what do I do? Maple herb works best against insects. Just one maple herb should be enough. That maple herb grows on cliffs. Bring it soon. I think I already have some. Do I not already have some? I do not already have some. Okay. That's right. I put it in the chest. Thank you for the posture check. Stretch and the hydrate. Rub rum. It's just like I'm stuck in a big spider web. Smiley face, literally. Literally, though. Oh, I brought the hydrate. Should be, yeah, it's right there. Maple herb. Maple herb. Let's go save a child. <laughs> Nanta, why are you threatening everyone? Do eat, take meds, and drink water. I feel like that. <laughs> Like this. Oh. Are you okay? Yeah, probably. Can you walk? Okay. Well, let's go to the witch's house together. Let's go and get away from that spider. Because I don't want to see the spider. What the... Alright, come along. Child. Are you okay? Are you hurt? Can't walk because my legs hurt. You're probably up there for too long. Then I'll give you a hug. I'll give you treatment at the witch's house. Okay. <laughs> We're just gonna ch carry this child. We can fry rocks. Pro right now's not the time. Let's finish carrying this child. Isn't it heavy? Of course! Really? Just stop talking. <laughs> it is heavy! You're- you're- it, it, It's a lot of effort to carry you around, and it would be way easier if you just walked. You cannot pass through now because the prickly vines. Let's go to the witch's house for now and find a way. Yeah. I'm gonna work now. Go do it. We're here? Wow, a witch's house. Thanks! Fox among spider webs. How's your life? Still hurts a little bit. I have to hurry up and get back to the village. If not, Grandma will scold me. Okay, leave it to me. I'll get rid of that huge prickly vine. Well, really? I'll make sure to get you back to your village. Don't worry. Okay, thanks. Oh, well, before that, I should treat your leg first. Rub, rub, wait here. Okay, let's fix that leg. How do we fix the leg? Uh, 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 candy, candy. Healing. I thought we had a healing candy. Soft candy. Alleviate muscle pain. Back scratch. Okay, this one. We need little. Uh, 
I don't think I have anything that can act. Ah. What? How do I heal the leg? How do I heal the leggy? Oh no. I don't know how to heal the leggy. Put a cran apple in there. Unreadable. Oh wait. Okay. 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 Recipe. Word. Yes. How do how do I how do I read the recipe? Uh, and use. Okay. Now we've got the recipe. Now can we make it? Healing candy. Okay, which flower extract and maple herb extract? Gotcha. Okay. Uh, I did. Oh. Nope, not that. Uh, which flower and maple? Which flower and maple? Which flower and maple? We need more maple. Give me that. Let's go get some more maple. Hello, little child. Thank you for the cookie, Ninetail. I appreciate it. <laughs> Forgot I can run. It's almost midnight, but I gotta get gotta get the maple. Oh, that's there's not more maple here. Um There's gotta be some over here, right? Also can I Catalog the maple, please. Maple, please. I guess not. Okay. We gotta run back. I don't know what time. If if there's like a curfew for the character, but I'd imagine midnight is. If there is, it's gonna be around midnight. <laughs> run, 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 run. Get back real quick. Okay. Maybe there's not. But at least we'll be home, so. Oh wait, we gotta get extra. Okay, it pauses when we're Maple herb extract. We needed that and which flower? What? Okay, I guess we're asleep. Oh, you just woke up. Why do you look dead already? I think I had an important dream, but I can't remember it. Seems like something important. Like the principal sermon? That's something I don't want to think about again. Okay, so I guess if it just gets to be midnight, we just pass out wherever we are. <laughs> okay. Um... Stage four, clockwise. Okay. Uh, clockwise. Hoggies. Okay, perfect. Here you go, child. Would you like to try this? Wow. What's this? Is it can- Yeah, it's a candy to heal your leg. Wow, thanks. It looks delicious. Oh, it's delicious. Ah, oh, this tastes awful. It's good for your health. How's your leg? Oh, I think I feel better. Thanks, Sally. The candy tastes awful. So how did you get caught in the spiderweb? Just came to the forest to play for a little bit. By the time- But time flew by and then the giant prickly vines were covering the way. I was looking for another path when I heard the sound of a train. Oh, it must be the one I was riding. I went towards the train, and strange birds suddenly started chasing after me. Must have been that, that bird, not the train. It, it was that bird. I went to a deep place as I was running away. Then I found a treasure map and got caught in the spider web as I was trying to pick it up. Treasure map? I saw a picture of a skeleton through the bushes. 
I saw in a children's book that it is, it's a sign of pirates leaving their treasure. Shall we go check? What about the gigantic prickly vine? Oh well, we can't do much about it yet. It wouldn't hurt to go try. Let's go. Ellie, can I follow you too? Wouldn't it be better to rest a little more? I'm bored since I'm home all the time. What do you say? Okay, fine, but be careful. Okay, thanks. I don't want to have to carry you, child. Oh, do I need to talk to you? Hello, Ellie. Any interesting stories? I thought you were going to follow me. Shop? I'm worried about which tea leaf to brew. Saw a moving flower in the forest. A moving flower? No, it was a flower. It swayed even when swayed even when there was no wind. Where did you see it? I saw it near the lake. Thanks, I'll go there later. Ellie, what kind of tea do you like? Uh, I don't. I feel like the character would likes tea, but I personally don't like tea. I guess amongst these options, sweet tea is the best. I like sweet tea. I also like sweet tea. I like bush apple tea with witch flower tea as well. I misread that as a romantic tea. I also read it as a romantic tea as well. <laughs> but you shouldn't drink too much sweet tea. They say it'll rot your teeth. Okay, I'll be careful. Any interesting stories? Nope. Okay, I guess I'm abandoning you even though you said you wanted to come. Bye! <laughs> <laughs> Rocks. Only like sweet tea, Irish or English breakfast. I don't like these. <laughs> Wait, I gotta write you down. There you are, child. How do I get? Okay, I can grab. Sprout will shiver or bloom with flowers. If you drop, they drop flowers behind. So, should you scare them away? If well, well fed, will bloom lots of flowers. Okay. Don't like coffee? I like, I like coffee. Treasure map. Okay. Let's look for the treasure map. A red chalk. What's this? Hello, Ellie. No, I don't want to talk to you. A boom potion. I even went to Hidden Library because I wanted to make it. I'm so lucky to find it here. They don't normally use a skeleton sign as a symbol of luck, right? So the important thing now is that I have something to blow things up with. And also something to blow up. You're super excited. Then shall we try it right away? I missed this feeling. Do you plan to destroy everything on the top on the top of getting in trouble? Hey, what do you take me for? Boom potion. Don't you feel the almighty power just for the name? When in trouble, throw it! Break it if you can't have it. Sometimes it takes boldness to overcome the crisis. Don't you think it's strange that a boom potion was dropped in that secluded forest? That is a good point. Someone must There's the child. <laughs> it took them long enough. Someone might have hidden it thinking it's tr that it's treasure like Rebrum. Someone might have spilled it. The boom potion? I don't know. The important thing now is that the boom potion is in my hands. Go! Boom potion! Wow, it won't even budge. Must be stronger than that secret door in the principal's office. Where are these fragments coming out? Ah, where? Around your feet. Look at this, Virgil. It's a prickly vine fra fragment. It seems to have worked a little bit, but the vines appear to have grown back pretty fast. We might be able to figure out exactly what these prickly vines are. These prickly vines aren't even in the codex. How are you going to figure that out? Well, oh, wouldn't a person living around here know something? Let's show the fragment to someone and ask them about it. How about the only person that is around here? Welcome. Do you, do you need anything? I forgot that they don't have the children's anyway. Oh, this is a fragment of that prickly vine. 
Vines, that's right. Do you know something about it? No, I don't know anything about prickly vines either. But I have something that might be helpful. Something that might be helpful? Ta-da! A universal product appraisal machine! Wow, what's that? It's a tool made by someone, some witch. With the power of the moon and the moonstone embedded here, you can find out the identity of any object. Really? Then hurry up and try it. I don't usually do this for free, but since you lifted my curse, I'll do it for free this time. Wow, that's great. All right, here it goes. Huh? What? The prickly vine fragment has disappeared. That's strange. Why did it disappear? Maybe because of the grudge against nature? No, that's not possible. This tool just shoots moonlight and analyzes the reflected light. There are no plants that just get killed by moonlight, right? Plant that gets killed by moonlight. Uh, it seems like something's coming up in my mind. Think, Ellie. This is something you learned in school. Oh, I remember now. Avoiding the moon. There are plants that get killed by moonlight. That's right. This prickly vine definitely avoids the moon. That's why it died in the moonlight. I think I've also heard of plants like that. I'm glad the tool is working fine. Thank you. I think I can get rid of the prickly vines now. No, I'm the one who should be thankful. Work hard. Do you need anything? Uh, uh no. Alright, so we need to make that moonlight potion then. Just find any information about moonflower. Okay. Let's go learn about Moonflower. So just go to it. Hi, how's it going? It's squish time. Thank you for letting me squish you. Thank you for letting me squish you. Okay. <laughs> the child can't follow us down here, so. <laughs> We're just gonna run in and we're just gonna be gone and they're gonna be like, oh okay, I guess this is fine. I get to work up something later. It's really useful. Okay, well, where else am I supposed to learn about moonlight? Moonflower. I guess upstairs? Or this book? Well that's part of the Okay. Gross coffee. I don't know. I, I find tea gross personally. So let's save. Let's get, let's get this started. The moonflower. Oh, this is where we investigate things. That makes sense. People have died from reading too many books, haven't they? So much for all that confidence. I actually have a disease that kills me if I read too many books, you know? That's relatable there. <laughs> Stop complaining and keep searching. We've only gone through three books so far. Only? Come on, look at the size of these books. It's too much work. Can you read instead? You sure you want to do that? Of course. We're friends, right? Looks like the next few lines are about the moonflower. What? Really? Let's see here. Bitter grape tea tree? I recently read Dracula for the first time. Nice. Bitter grape tea tree. That's the tree we saw at the summit. Glowing one. The glow came from the blue moon butterflies. Hmm. The tea leaves. Blah, blah, blah. Tastes like grape. Strong bitter taste. Oh, here it is. Blah, blah, blah. It's always so. It's also famous for the flowers. The moonflower. Moonflower. So it was here. There's still more information. Hmm. It gathers moonlight most of the time, and on moonless nights, the moonflower blooms. Moonless. A moonless night. But the tree at the summit had a blue moon butterflies flying around. So the moonflower couldn't bloom because of the moonlight emitted by blue moon butterflies. So if we get rid of the blue moon butterflies, then the moonflowers will bloom. Yeah, it's a commonly used method back in the Lucery or two. Gather moonlight with the blue moon butterflies, shoo them away, and then collect the moonflower. Alright, let's get rid of the blue moon butterflies. Make lunar's oil and remove the prickly vines. But what do we use to get rid of the blue moon butterflies? They don't like sunlight, so a sunlight potion should work. Alright, let's make a sunlight potion and get rid of those butterflies.
Do we have the recipe for a sunlight potion? Sunlight potion. We do! Witch flower. Okay. Yeah, that's all easy stuff. We need to get maple herb. And another witch flower. Well, that was easy. <laughs> now just the maple herb. <laughs> Party on. It's a party cow. Cows are so cute. Honestly, humans don't deserve cows. They're just so cute. They're so sweet. I love them. I love them. So. Let's get extra of the maple leaf stuff because it's where every recipe needs it. <laughs> We don't need the dingle mango, but we might need it later, so we could just grab it now. Okay. Extracts. Bye, Rub Rum. Rub Rum's just enjoying being there. All right, witch flower. We need a witch flower. Squishy Chub. And maple herb. Right. I'm gonna double check. Witch flower, maple herb, squishy chub. Perfect. Oh wait, what was... okay. Stage 5, clockwise. Wait, what did it help? Uh, pour in the right vessel. Right vessel? Is all, do all of the... okay, they all do that. I can... okay. Uh, so, stage 5, clockwise, all three of these. Hopefully we didn't just mess it up. Okay, we're good. Sunlight potion. Beautiful. My potion's ready. Let's go to the tree right away. Ellie, the lunar oil is... Don't worry, I already have the ingredients. You already have them? First is the moonflower. Do you really want to go now? Did you do everything you want to do? Yeah. Stop wasting time. If you're done, let's talk to Rub Rum and go. Okay. Wait, I don't have all the ingredients. Okay, do I- I don't have a phoenix feather. Am I going to get a phoenix feather? Like, I don't- I don't think I have phoenix feather, do I? Put the rocks in. Why are you burning down- why are you guys burning down chat? What the fuck? <laughs> What the heck? <laughs> I guess we can just... Alright, let's go. Oh, I guess... We're... Wait, they're stuck to the tree as expected. Wow, there's a... there are tons of shining butterflies. You're gonna make them all go away now, right? feel so bad for them all of a sudden. It's for the tree's sake. Hurry up and sprinkle the moon. The potion. Alright, here it goes. We're gonna flash bang them all. Yep, it's a flash bang. You ever just flash bang a bunch of butterflies? Whoa! Ah, oh, it's beautiful. Where are those butterflies going? Wouldn't they go back to where they came from? But the flowers... Oh, over there! Over there! Oh! They're so pretty! Oh my god! 
so beautiful. Yes, it's really, really beautiful. Now, we can just pick up Moonflower and make Lunar's Oil. Rub Rub, can you go to the Prickly Vines and wait for us there? We'll come as soon as the Moon Oil is ready. Okay, I'll be waiting in front of the vines. Alright, let's get the Moonflower. Alright, let's go to this dispensary now. Can I not? Okay. Yes, I was like, can I not go get the other? We need a phoenix feather. There's no way to find a phoenix right here. You have a phoenix feather right here. You told me about it earlier. What? Oh, Ellie, that's not a good idea. If we do that, we might not be able to get back on the train. We might not be able to make it to Highlight. A witch is always ready to help, starting with the one who needs it the most. That again? You just like it here better. Oh, of course. You just don't like the witch's house in Highlight. That's true. Stop being childish. You're going to regret it later. No, Virgil. What I will regret is not doing this right now. I'm sure of it. You have to be smart about this. Ugh. Alright, well... Great, I have all the ingredients now. Ellie, you're worse than Arya sometimes. Oh, please, I'm nowhere near as good as my mother. That wasn't a compliment. Alright, now let's make Lunar's oil. Let's get that. What if we mess this up? <laughs> what if we messed up this potion? What would the game do? Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, I wanted to save real quick. Okay, stage one, don't stir. We won't mess it up. Well, God, I'm curious. <laughs> don't stir, don't stir. There we go. Woohoo! Lunar soil is ready. Let's go get rid of the prickly vine now. Oh. I'm here. Now let's hurry up and get rid of the annoying vines. Um, huh? Did you happen to suffer somehow because of me? Don't worry about that. This was my choice. What I really wanted to do. And this is my choice. Thanks, Sally. It's no big deal. You can come to the witch's house anytime you want. Are you going to stay here? Yeah, I think I'm gonna I'll keep staying here as an apprentice. Really? Really? Really. Keep up the good work, Rubrum. Okay, keep up the good work too, Ellie. Hi, how's it going, Jordy? I'm doing good. Uh, we're we're doing great. Um, we just opened up the way to the uh, village. Hurry up and go home for now. Your grandma must be worried. I'll find you later. Okay, see you in a bit. Yeah. Quit acting like a saint. This place seems fun to you, that's all. Virgil, try not to say stuff that makes me sound like a bad guy, will you? It's a happy ending for it all if I have fun and they're happy, isn't it? Will the teachers get angry? Like mother, like daughter. That's what they'll say. Well, that's great. I already told you, it's not a compliment. Alright, let's head to the village now. It said a happy ending. I have finally arrived at the village. Yeah, it's a village. What kind of village would it be? I hope lots of fun things happen there. There would be a lot of annoying things to take care of. I was always expecting something like that. Let's hurry up and go. Okay, we got it. As much as I would love to begin an apprenticeship, I think I'm just gonna go save real quick. Oh, we gotta, we gotta get this pumpkin cake first. <laughs> No, get over here. I got it. I got it. I got to squish you. Thank you. Got to squish another one. Get over here. Squish, squish. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh. Grab a couple of ingredients while we're out here already. 
and then I'm gonna go save, and I think we'll pick this up back up another time, you know? It's a little bit late for me. I'm a little sleepy. So, yeah. Get that. Can we not pick these up? They just kind of make bell sounds. That's fine. Um, is there anything else? Right, let's just go back and see. This game is very cute. I love the art style of this game. I it's it's so it's so cute. <laughs> Ooh, I didn't know the pumpkin glows in the dark. That's poggers. Okay, so we're supposed to explore. Alright, let's see. Alright. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate you all stopping by and enjoying the stream so far. Um Let's raid Jessica. I, I feel like I missed some. Nope, I didn't miss. Oh, just just Ninetales saying that they're going to do arson in my chat and then proceeding to do arson in my chat. Froggy raid, hell yeah. All right. Let's go raid Jessica. It's going to be great. <laughs> Thank you all so very much for watching. I appreciate you all so very much. Thank you to the new followers, Durs, Lil Pumpkin Kid, and TG Knox. And thank you, thank you again, Worm, for the 10 bits. I appreciate it. Um, yeah, I should double check. Jessica's not in the stream. Oh shit, is there an ad going on right now? Guys, tell me, is there an ad going on right now? Because it just said time since last ad is 40 seconds. Uh, well, hopefully, uh, hopefully there's not an ad going on right now. <laughs> uh, ho hopefully there wasn't. An ad. Was there an ad just barely? I'm sorry, everyone, if there was an ad. I'll, I'll reread the credits real quick. Okay. Uh, thank you to the new followers, uh, Durs, Knox, and Lil Pumpkin Kid. And thank you again, Worm, for the 10 bits. Um, yeah, we're going to go raid Jessica, so make sure to refresh your page so it counts um, as a view when we go on there. And I'll talk to you guys later. Oh, yeah, join the Discord if you haven't already. Um, it's a great time. Bye, everybody.